with Joe Duca, and we're playing the first ever game of Age of Sigmar 2. Are you excited, Joe? Very excited. Very excited. All right. Uh, we were able to build and paint the entire starter set in about a week, uh, generously provided by Heroes World, although we are giving them the models back. So, <laughs> so is it our generosity or their generosity? But uh, yeah, so we wanted to uh, basically uh, take everyone through the starter box, try to play a couple games, uh, try to use endless spells, and in the second game, I think this 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 first game we're gonna play is uh, very introductory, right? Very, so yeah. that's gonna be our our perspective is to try to just uh, as if you're a brand new player to Age of Sigmar. There's probably gonna be lots of new interest in Age of Sigmar, and uh, we're just going to take it as if it's day one, yeah. right? So one step at a time, brand new. Yeah. So why don't we just start at least with what do you get in the box? Uh, there, it's actually, you can see here, there's quite a number of models. So let's start out with the, the, uh, the golden boys, li literally speaking. So this is the Lord, Lord, Lord Arcanum. Arcanum. Yeah. So Joe, why don't you talk about the Lord Arcanum? Nice. So just out of the box, you get the nice two, I guess it's a one big piece card. So he's got a lot of rules on it. Um, but what makes him cool though? What makes him cool is he's got a lot of abilities, like a lot, like really situational on what you're going to need. Like, for example, the um, Atheron Strike, each time you make a roll of six for the Rift Charger's Razor Claws, inflict one mortal wound, which is like, he just gets that, which is nice. Once per turn, friendly Stormcast Eternal model slain within 18 of this model. Instead of removing the slain model, you can heal one wound that has been allocated to it. So that'll come in handy, like later on. So he's got a lot of uh, good buffs, so the synergies will work. And you're going to see a little bit later, like there's a lot of cross synergies between the units. Uh, so I guess figuring those out is going to be the key to really uh, utilizing these characters correctly. All right, we don't got all day. Let's move all on right. to another unit. Another unit. So what about these guys over here, the Evocators? Evocators, these guys are pretty cool. They're actually wizards. So they can bind, or so they can unbind and they can cast one spell, but they have a set spell. Um, which is good, which is... Empower. Empower. Yeah. So it's pick a friendly redeemer or sarnastic unit within eight of this caster until the next hero fears you can reroll failed wound rolls for that unit, which is good because it can, I guess if it's going to be them, like their keyword is there, it also goes over to the sequitors later, so you can either put it on them or... The well, this whole, arm, this whole army is sacrosanct, right? So I can't let your pronunciation go. Like, you have to actually pronounce this word correctly. Sacrosanct? Yeah, that's right. All right. <laughs> All right. I butchered that one. You butchered it. So. What about these guys over here, the sequiturs? These guys are the meat and potatoes. They are the meat and potatoes. So I guess they're your upgraded liberators from before. Um, hit on three, wound on three, which is really nice. Now, in contrast, what is a liberator hit on? Hits on four is usually wounds on threes. Oh, so sad. It's sad, it's sad. sad but uh, yeah. it looks like these guys may be coming forward. They're also better overall. like cause it, Not because they have the shield and their hitting is better. They can empower their weapons or their shield. So they're like, it's it's a really good one. All right, cool. What about this guy over here? Or this girl, this the girl, Knight Encantor. Knight Encantor. She's a, a generally good wizard overall. Nothing super um, exciting really stands out. But she does, you know. Hit and wound on threes, which is normal for a character, but the D3 damage is really nice. Oh, for a wizard, that's pretty good. For a good. wizard, that's really good. That's really right? good. Plus a three up save, bravery nine. That's usually bravery's not the highest on Stormcast in general. Oh, yeah, but you're mo one, mo one model. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter, but you never know. You never know, apparently. You never okay. know with all the well, new spells. Why don't we go over here to the castigators? These guys, these uh, the new shooting. The new shooting, which are pretty good. I uh, like the ability. The prime hits on a two like the previous judicators which is nice and then on a six to hit uh, there's an attack with this unit's uh thunder great bulls or inflicts d3 hits instead of one which so is nice the exploding the explode yes yeah. so the whole unit gets an exploding uh oh, okay bomb I yeah guess. wonderful wonderful <laughs> so all, all the old stormcasts have got brand new better versions of their old, old stuff that's pretty much it. that's what it seems like and then speaking of the new hotness the first ever war machine in age of sigmar uh, new sculpt, anyhow. The Celestar Ballista. Yeah, this should be pretty interesting. I really want to see, because it has the two shooting profiles, the single shot or the rapid fire. And it's going to be interesting to see which one is uh, 
going to be better overall. Like, I, I really don't know. So we're going to say, I guess it's on averages, because a single shot hits on a three, and then the rapid fire hits on a five, but it's just more shots, I guess. It's, uh, we're going to have to play and see what's going to happen. All right. So you guys are going to have to forgive us, because we just got this starter set last Sunday, and now it is Sunday. So we've built and painted all of this stuff. So uh, our knowledge of the armies is not... Uh, sharp because basically we've Very been limited. just we've been heads down painting our asses off building and painting our asses off so even when it comes to the nut the night haunts so, so these are all joe's paint jobs over here uh yeah they're very joe like in terms <laughs> of airbrush and uh specific style then you come over to the night haunts over here now these boys they're, they're the ones that i painted why don't we start here over here with the chain rasp port so um you in the box you get 20 of these guys so the the minimum unit is actually 10 but you get so a pretty beefy unit. Uh, they're they're pretty good. I mean, you know, basically this entire army flies. Nobody walks. They don't. Have, they don't even have legs. Uh, <laughs> if you notice, except for the horse. The horse has legs. That's the only thing that has that. But it flies still. Um, they have basically this ethereal rule, which um, means that they have a four up, unmodifiable save. So it's always a four up. You can't plus it. You can't minus it. Ren doesn't matter. They don't care. Right. So. It's pretty cool. These guys here, uh, they're cool because uh, basically they're just, uh, they're, they're relatively cheap, like 100 points for 10. They have two attacks. Uh, and uh, when you get, when you keep this guy around, they have bravery 10. So as long as this guy doesn't die, bravery 10 is good. That's a big difference, right? Uh, let's go over here to the Guardian of Souls. I think he's our main caster out of everybody here, I think. Yeah, I think so. And uh, basically he's pretty cool too. I mean, like he can, uh, he can give rerolls to one, uh, to wound rolls for melee weapons for friendly night haunts, which is this entire army within nine inches. Within is a key distinction, not wholly within. Uh, and his uh, his uh, spell is a uh, spectral lure, which is uh, if I'm within 18 inches of the caster, I can either heal d6 wounds, or, or I can return a number of slain models, so I can kind of resurrect uh, dudes back, right? Um, that's going to be important for these guys here, the Glaive Wraith Stalkers, these, uh, dudes with the big blades, they got reach two, they got a couple attacks, four up, uh, three up, no random damage one. What's so cool about them is that, um, uh, when you charge, they get to, uh, reroll, reroll failed hits. It's pretty good. The reroll failed hits. I mean, yeah, it's all right. <laughs> I think they'll be fine. Um, then we get over to this side over here. Now that that's when you start getting to the real hotness. The Spirit Torment. This guy, uh, you can he, he can heal. And if I kill Stormcast Eternal models, I get to heal three wounds instead of just D3. Yeah. Oh, oh, how convenient. Some Stormcast <laughs> over here. Stormcast ready to, ready to die. Great. And then, uh, but also uh, for all uh, Night Haunt units that are wholly within 12, I get to reroll... Um, Rolls of hit rolls of one, so it's not bad. So he's he's good for buffing. These guys over here, the Grim Grass Reapers, they're 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 good. So basically, you see this guy with this uh, bell? bell thing. Well, they call it a death knell, which is a pretty pretty good uh, name. Yeah. Uh, Seems scary. When he when he does, you have to kind of roll for him separately. But you if you do him first, uh. What does it say? Each enemy model that is slain by wounds inflicted by the death knell, you can inflict one mortal wound on an enemy model within three inches of the death knell. That's pretty far. And uh, if a unit has five or more models, you can reroll failed hit rolls for this the sides. Now this is, they're pretty good, like four up, three up, rend one, damage one for the regular guys, and the death knell is damage two. So that's pretty good. Three and it's three up, three up. So funnily, the bell is the most deadly weapon out of the three. <laughs> freaking bell it's a bell, <laughs> it's a bell. <laughs> this guy is so good with it why don't they all just use the bell i don't know <laughs> doesn't make sense all right so now we have the two big boys of the of the uh army we got the lord executioner he's a pretty cool model um and uh basically he if i wound you on a roll of six i get to add two to my damage my damage is one granted so i go to damage three just on to wound roll of six so that's pretty good and uh at the, start of the end, at the start of a combat phase, I can pick an enemy hero within three inches of him, and then that enemy hero is negative one to hit, just in general. So it doesn't even have to be against me. I can just debuff your 
your dude over here, your Griffhound, or your Lord Arcanum over here, just by being within three inches at the start of any uh, combat phase. Oh, so neg, neg one hit. That's right. Stay away from the big axe boy. And then the Knight of Shrouds, he's, uh, he's on a horse. Uh, <laughs> he's, um, let's take a look here. Allocate, blah, blah, blah. Each time a wound inflicted by the sword slays an enemy hero, heal one. That's, that's okay. I have to kill, kill heroes. Uh, all, your, all your models are heroes, right? <laughs> hmm. All right. And then the command trait is that, uh, yeah, he's the one with the command trait. Uh, he's got, you can use the command ability to start a con at the combat phase. If you do so, pick a friendly night hunt unit that's wholly within 18 inches. Add one to the attacks characteristics of that unit's melee weapons. So that's really good because, I mean, these Grimgrass Reapers, I mean, they, they will love extra attacks. Or even the, the Ghost Glaive Stalkers are pretty good. Or even these guys. I mean, like, 20 dudes, they throw down, like, they're on 25 mils. So yeah, the chain ra the chain rasp forwards, yeah. So you get twenty five mils. You can get two ranks in basically, and they have two attacks each. So you make them three attacks each. Yeah, I mean they hit on four plus moon of four plus, but still. Volume, man. Yeah, volume, right? That's a lot of attacks. So yeah, that's that's basically the armies. Can you describe maybe just the building and painting aspect, Joe? And just like say like how it was to build and paint this army. Build I mean to to where it's at now, anyways. Yeah, to build them wasn't so bad. Because uh, a lot of them are press fit, just two pieces and then a head might be separate. So that wasn't so bad. You just kind of have to, on some models, angle it just right to get them to fit yeah. nice and flush. Yep. Uh, I just would have liked to have been able to like pose a couple of guys differently just because they're very static, right? A lot of doubles of the same model. Yeah. So Which is okay, but I guess for the starter set, it's great. Uh, but a lot of detail. Quality is phenomenal. Yeah. Uh, very fun to paint for sure. Yeah, I mean, you're not 100% done. I mean, there's still some detail that needs to be done on these guys. Definitely, there's still some black showing. that. Uh, but to get, to get this all all of this built and painted in like a week, it's pretty pretty fast, I'd say. Yeah. Right? Most people would not be able to get this much done to this level of quality within a week. I mean, I will say this, that uh, the Nighthawn side, uh, it wasn't that bad to build, uh, except I think the push fit for Nighthawn. Like you can see, these models are a lot spindlier than like the Stormcast. Like these, look at this beefcake over here. He's huge. My chain rasp dude is just like he's on like this like tiny thing, and uh, you know, you know, I actually don't know if you, where that line is. Oh, it's back here. But the problem is, is that when you push it in, they're not like perfectly like like this. They're actually kind of like angled. So you want to slap them together, but you can't. You actually have to like. Slap them in like at a 45, oh, 45 degree, yeah. 45 degree angle. And when they're spindly like this, it's a little scary. Like it's, yeah, it'd be a little frustrating. It's a, it can be frustrating because there, there's definitely times where it's like, it's really like t aggressively push fit. Like it's, it's aggressively like engineered to the millimeter type of thing. Right? Yeah. So like it yeah. feels like when you're pushing it, you're like, okay, if I put more force, it will definitely go in. But like, am I going to snap this thing? Yeah. And when it comes to the night haunts, I'm like, oh my god! Like, I'm I'm totally afraid of snapping it, and uh, I may or may not have snapped some things that I have had to glue back on. So <laughs> that's why that's why I got scared. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, that's but painting it I thought was fantastic. I mean, these are these are great sculpts. I, I honestly have to say the Nihon stuff I think are just looks dead yeah. sexy. Oh, I think they hit the the nail on the head on that one. Yeah, and I'm looking forward to the rest of the Nihon releases. Uh, whatever comes out. Black Coach, Black Coach, yeah, all day. Really cool. So uh, this is just the intro to the armies. Thanks. Okay, so we're set up here for our first uh, first game of Age of Sigmar 2. The mission we're playing is Blood and Glory, which is it's a pretty straightforward mission where you just have four objectives, um, and you just deploy, and you get objectives, and then at the end, end of the fifth turn, who has more objectives wins. If you tie then you go into tie break scenarios which is like who killed more or whatever and uh so yeah um there's a couple of tweaks uh, if you've played hsmr1 that's different uh, with the new edition one is that uh the objectives don't have to be babysat technically anymore so if you have uh an objective you have it until someone takes it from you so um you can walk off and then basically be uh, holding that objective and if no one ever comes and gets it then that's still yours so um, and there's an auto win condition here too where if you have all four objectives then you automatically win yeah. and so yeah also I'm not a fan of these uh, 
this art over here, Joe. This is Age of Sigmar <laughs> art. This is a courtesy of Dream Tea. So make sure you hit up Dream Tea, Dream, and then T-E-E dot store for if you want any objectives. These are perfect because they're a perfect three inch neoprene mat. Now in, in this mission is technically six inches. So all you have to do is just measure three off of here, but it's very useful to have something like that. Anyways, so let's see uh, who gets to throw down first. I think we're both at the same number of drops. So this will yep. tell us who gets to basically go first or a choice. Two versus three. Uh, That's right, baby. Yep. Do I want that double turn? Why don't you deploy first, Joe? Okay, we'll right. be back once we're done deploying. Okay, Joe, this is uh we've deployed. You can see here, he's got his sequiturs to the right and uh, his uh, ballista to the left. Yeah, ballista, intent or the female sorcerer. Yeah. Evocators. Evocators? Evocators. I think it's evocators. I mean, I'm gonna let the internet decide if you're right, but I'm pretty sure it's evocators. But you can stick with evocators if you want. That's fine. I like because they evoke things. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm sticking with. Okay, that's so fine. Proving wrong. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I mean, you can keep saying that. That's fine. And I have over <laughs> here uh, my big unit of chain rasps and um, the dude that is the wizard. What's his name? Uh, the guardian of souls. And then everybody else is over here. They're chilling. Just ignore them. They're fine. Yeah, They're not, okay. <laughs> you can just ignore them. I don't them. like those uh, big characters. You, there. What characters? There's nothing there. They're, they're, they're ghosts. They're the threat. Get them. Yeah. Send everything over there, Joe. Okay. So, what will you do? What are you planning on doing? You uh, finished the point first. Yep. You're the same number of drops, and I said that you should go first, even though that was stupid, but okay. Yeah. What do you want to do? Do you want me to go first or do you want to go first? You get choice, right? I will let you go first. Let me go first. Yep. Okay, that's fine. All right. Sweet. Biggest mistake of your life, Joe. Biggest mistake of your life. We'll see. We'll see. All right. Fine. All right, let's start with the hero phase. Night shrouds. Mmm. He's going to add one to the uh, melee characteristics of these dudes. We should also note that a command, there's command points now in Age of Sigmar. Yep. So technically, the way you get command points is you get one per turn. You can accumulate those, and then you can burn, you can use them uh, for command abilities. So actually, I, what am I doing? I'm not going to use that. This, that's the old look. So I'm not going to use that command point for that. I'm just going to stow that. Yeah, uh, gonna I'm going to I'm going to store it for now. Uh, but you'd also get one if you're like for 50 points under or if you have a battalion. So we don't have any battalions because we're playing straight out of the box. So I just have one command point so far. Um, do I do I want to cast any magic? Ba and baby do I ever. Um, all right, sweet. So let's go with, uh, what's his face? I'm just going to keep calling him that. The Guardian of Souls. He is uh, going to be casting on these chain rafts over here. It's going to give him Mystic Shield. Because Mystic Shield doesn't modify their save. It gives them reroll of one. Oh. So it works on Night Haunts. All right, six out of six. Oh, barely. Who's casting it? This dude. This are you within 30? 30 of this unit or this unit? Why? Are they also magicians? Or? Yeah, they can unbind. Can they? Well, yeah, then, they're wizards. Well, then let's, the unit of, of, uh, let's see. Evocator is a wizard. Well, it has two or more models. Oh, you're definitely within. You're definitely within. Yeah. All right, so which I rolled a six. Oh, oh I, beat you. I think so, yeah. So, oh, good. excellent, excellent. Biggest mistake of your life, like I said. What? <laughs> um, all right, so let's do some. Um, I guess that's basically it. I mean, uh, prayers. <laughs> Who prays, anyways? Prayers are for losers. What if I could? Gold face losers. Okay. Uh, chain rasps. Let's move this. Let's move these bad boys, and they move pretty fast, I think. Right? We're gonna move like six. Six. I want them to run. So D six. It's a four. That's ten, baby. Ten. 
one big difference is now uh, the double turn has been tweaked. It's a big difference in a way, but it's also not as big of a difference as you think it would be. Slight modification. I wouldn't so, say it's like game changing, but it's, no. it's enough that you gotta think about it. Definitely. And what happens is that people basically, it's cool, it's cool. I'll connect the line, it's cool. Um, is that they will, um, they either want it gone or they love double turn. I'm a double turn guy, so I love keeping the double turn. The fact that they changed it to this, I ain't mad. It's fine. I mean, it could have been worse. They could have gotten rid of it. You know, I think Age of Sigmar 2 is it's largely a tweaking of the game as we know it. So. Well, I think it's going to matter later on because the, the wizards are going to be a bigger thing. Well, much bigger. Much bigger thing. Much so bigger. that phase is going to be a lot bigger. Yeah. So I'll well, wait to see what actually happens. Like, well, these guys don't summon the way that like things summon, right? So like other army summons. So we'll see how that goes. Yeah. Okay. So I got this guy, and uh, plus the boo-boo. Okay, that's fine. Darn it, I'll put them there like that. All right, these guys over here, they're running. Let's go. Grim Gas Reapers, how fast do you move? Eight normally. X gonna give it to you. Eight plus a total. Oh, One. Nine. Garbage. <laughs> Not as far as you'd like. Okay, well, whatever. I'm just gonna, I'll, I'll move them afterwards. These other dudes with the spears. Whatever they're called. It's plus six. How much do they move? They move six. So I'm, I'm moving them 12. That's nice. Uh, the Spear Torment, they move six. Plus another four. That's ten. And this dude here, he's moving four. So he moves ten. You know, everyone's basically moving in and around the same speed. And the Knight of Shrouds moves 12 plus three. So 15. 15, Joe, just for you. So ten. Do you want a piece of him, Joe? I know you do. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to try and kill him. You're not. Nah, you don't have to. He's, He's dead already, Joe. I'm going to have to try and He's dead. out of existence. Whatever. I feel that he will do a lot of damage if I leave him yeah, uh, yeah. unkempt. Good. Then leave the Grim Grass Reapers alone. Yeah. They didn't do anything to you, Joe. Just ignore them. They're just little ghosties. Yeah. I'm afraid of ghosts. Yeah, you would. You would, just like you were afraid of, what's that movie called? The Exorcist? What is it? You love that movie. 12. These guys move 12, eh? Yeah. All right, let's just, let's just back them up. You want something? You're going to get you're gonna get poked if you get close. Too close, Joe. Ah, uh, not me eyes. That's right. Not a, I'm going to get you right in the raccoon wounds. <laughs> All in the raccoon wounds, Joe. And 10. Ooh. And, uh, uh, you know what? He's just going to chill like this. He don't, he don't need, he doesn't need to get that far. No. Just back him up, make sure he's within three. It's cool. All right. That's it for movement. Shoosting phase, zero. Okay. No guns. Uh, assault phase, nothing. That's it. Bottom of one. Joey do. All right. It's on you. Turn one. Hero phase. Mm-hmm. I will try his this guy's arcane bolt. Whoa. Which is the uh, souped up version for him. Soup bolt. Yeah, so if this model successfully casts arcane bolt and is not unbound, then the spell inflicts d3 mortal wounds instead of one, or d6 mortal wounds instead of d3 if it's ten or more. What's the range on that thing? It doesn't say, but I'm, I'm no, it must say. Doesn't say. Come on, come on, Joe. No, it says Pride Electris. It says if I cast Arcane Bolt, so I'm assuming it's Arcane Bolt. Arcane Bolt range. They're just buffed up. Okay. I think is eighteen. Eighteen should be far enough to get a, your character if I can. You want that guy? I want that guy because I'm afraid of that guy. Bro, what are you afraid of him for? He just has a gigantic axe. That's all. Yeah. <laughs> Giant, giant it's axe. It's pretty big. Of, it's almost the size just of one he, of my guys. Just because he has an axe of death doesn't mean that he's going to kill anything. All right. Well, just Arcane because. Bolt him. And I'm looking for a 10 or more. Yep. I got oh, three. Oh, you so miscast. I missed. I didn't miscast. I just failed. Oh. 
It's no such thing as miscast. No such thing as miscast. Yeah. 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 So that, that was a little uh, sucky. Unless I use a command point, but it doesn't make sense. What would you command point? Can we roll one? It's not 4K, bro. I think you can. Hmm? It's, uh... You look it up. Because you can use command points for other things, not just... Other yeah, you can. Yeah. One is reroll for charges. Yeah. One is reroll for um, so one is inspiring presence. Yeah. One is reroll charges. One yeah. is reroll runs. There's nothing for no. Or anything like that. No, there's no there's no blanket All fate right. fate weaver reroll. Ugh. That's what that's part of the bullshit of 40k. I mean, uh, the <laughs> wonderful 40kness. All right. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna cast from the Night and Cantor Spirit Storm on a seven. Uh, if successfully cast, each enemy unit within 18 of the caster suffers a moral wound. In addition, in your next hero phase, you get to minus one to your run and charge rolls. So, you never know. Might as well just try and get a wound off here or there. Two within 18. Yep. Bring it, baby. One seven. I ain't never scored. Jeez. That's, that's nice, nice not rolling there, Joe. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty just watch. I'm going to get murdercated, though, when it comes to close combat. I hope so. I can only hope. And the Evocators, I'm happy now. Uh, uh, yeah. They will that's, empower. That's slightly better. Yeah, slightly better, thanks. I'm going to empower onto themselves. Mm -hmm. On a six. Mm -hmm. uh, you need eight, blah, blah, blah. You can reroll failed wound roll for that unit. So on an eight on themselves. Nah. Jeez. You got nothing, Joe. I'm using different. You're, get, you're getting zeros. I'm zeros. Big that's time. it for your magic phase. Magic or phase, that's not, it. Not, I mean, hero phase. That's it. That's all I got. That's it. You're not, you don't got anyone praying for you, too. No prayers. Sigmar doesn't hear your prayers. No, no one can pray. This chamber is empty. <laughs> Let's go. All right, it's time to. I guess I gotta go forward over here. Do you have to, or you can just hide like a baby? I have to roll to see if my guys come in from reserve. Oh. In the movement phase. Yeah. All right. So three up. No. Nope. Wow, that's nothing. Smoking. You get none. You get nothing. Zero. You All deserve. Right. You deserve it. Couldn't be happier. The question is, do I move? You're gonna be in charge during next round. I want to push you out as much as possible, and I don't think I'll be able to move far enough to really charge that second twelve. So if these guys are gonna move and run, the second would move five plus six. Woo. Okay. They have the. They have a mighty wind behind them. They do. When they were uh, regular people or regular heroes, they were all um, descendants of Usain Bolt. <laughs> nice. That's what happens. Uh, these guys are just going to move up. Uh, sure. I might as well run them. Might as well. You ain't got no guns. Two. You ain't got no guns. You ain't going to be a char you ain't charging me. Yeah. I can't. I'm not in range to charge you. That's okay. But I don't want you to come over and take over my stuff. But it doesn't really matter right now. You also might get the double. You might get a double turn on me. I might get a double turn. So you might. Well. Oh yeah. Also, we should note we're part of the starter box. You get this handy dandy measuring thing. Not so whippy anymore. Doesn't get a good like those red sticks. They smack each other. They're not. They're not as. Hold up. Oh, that was pretty good. Sounds good, but no real pain, you know. Yeah. And then you get these cool night haunt dice. I'm calling them night haunt dice because they're blue and white. They Look are at that. Color. They're not gold. Ugh. 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 I'm just gonna move these guys and attempt a charge, so it's gonna go up five. What? You're attempting to charge with three dudes on me? They have four attacks each, and they're empowered. Bro. Bro. I get this they, damage. You failed. And they're not empowered. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. The. Unless I'm wrong. No, no, no. no you no, definitely, failed. you definitely, failed everything. you failed everything. I failed everything like a sucker. <laughs> I was like, I don't remember you passing oh. anything. I'm gonna back this guy up a little bit. Back that ass, yeah. I can only go three inches. That model is so thick. Wizard, I want to keep her alive a little bit longer, so she's just going to back up. Yeah, you back that up. All right. Back that ass up. And this guy. Oh, do big chicken. I want to move really, really fast. The big chicken. Are you going to chick Are you going to chicken me? Thing is, if I go, like, because it moves 12, that's pretty, like, I can get there, and I'll be within charge range. Yeah, charge me. But then, no, I'm afraid. <laughs> Why? What are you afraid, afraid of? No, I think he's just going to chill back here and wait for the right moment to pop out. That's what he's going to do. He's living up to the chicken moniker. Yep. What is this? This is bullshit. That's it. That's, it. That's all I need to do right now. Let's get some uh, shooting in. The Basilica. I'm going to go for the rapid fire. 
So it's four attacks, hitting on fives, and successful hits, the D6 hits this guy. Where are you shooting at? The chain rasp? Chain rasp. Okay, cool. So that's... Two hits. Two hits. That's a lot that's of hits. Two D6. That's a lot. Roll low. Six. 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 It could be worse. Although that's still a lot of hits. What's this model? Like 140? He's... Yeah, this thing is around there. Yeah, anyways. And so threes. The wound. Minus two, one damage, but it doesn't matter because it's threes. So it's... Four? Four. Four? So minus one means nothing. Minus two, sorry, means nothing. It means nothing. It does nothing. Cool. Um, I'm missing shield in them, right? Yep. All right, so they have a five up save because they're uh, former prisoners. They don't get much. So five up. We're re-rolling ones. Oh, baby! Oh. I made none, but I gotta re-roll that one. Five up! Hey, oh, come to the play! What happened? Take that, Joe. All right. Uh, I'll okay. take three down. That's fine. That's fine. That's right. You, see, you know why I'm taking these wins, right? Yep. Yeah, yeah. You see how he's come. Just in case I can possibly get those guys. That's right. Uh, those are, unfortunately, all my guns right now. That's right. Because your charge phase. Your other dudes are too busy hanging out. Hanging out. All right. Who's so charging? These guys are going to... Go for the bomb. Try to long bomb me. This is nine. So you'll, you'll need a nine. I need a nine. All right. If I can cast... No, I'm not using those red dice. Blue dice. That's all. Need a nine. Superstition. Nine! Is it superstition? Is yeah, it? Is. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so we got that. And then this guy is good. Because I'm going to... I want to limit the amount of attacks he can shoot back. And yeah. So I'm gonna Makes sense. wrap around. And... Those are all my charges for Technically, now. Technically, you can't, like, you have like you have to get in closer to that closest model. So you can't, like, take this oh, guy. You can't, like, run in this way. No, no, no. I'm going to move these guys. He's going to move to here to touch. He's yeah. going to move here to touch. He's going to move there to touch. Uh, okay, sure. Because everybody's moved sure, sure, sure. closer. Uh, yeah, I guess so. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. I think it's fine. Okay. It's, a, it's like a slight tweak to what it was. That's why. Yeah. It's, a, it's a tweak from... The yeah, one. not a big change, but enough. All right, so combat phase. Combat Let's phase. do this. So I will activate my only unit. So like I said before, he's going to wrap around to touch this guy. So he's closer now. He's going to go to move to here to touch him. He's now, but see, that's this is where the problem is. You were close. You were closer to him, right? Like this, oh. not not touching. Okay. So, so you have to right. end up at least as close. Uh, you have to end up no further away from him. So, so you can do. So you can you can bounce to here. But if you end up in, let's say base to base with this guy, the first guy, you're good. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't you can't get a, you can't back up further okay. from the closest guy you were at. Okay, so he'll be fine there and he'll just go to and there. And you can bump through there. That's right. Bump yeah. There. yeah. And that's it. Everybody should still be within an inch of each other. Make sure it's legal. Yeah. There we go. Cool. And that's that. Cool. All right. So bring the pain. These guys have four attacks each. And I think that's yeah, nothing really I'm not empowered, so it's nothing really too fancy. And the prime gets one extra attack. And that's it. Threes and threes. Threes and threes. That's one guy. One guy has five attacks? Yeah, four attacks base. Oof. The champ has one. Spicy meatball. Yeah, that's why I've got to get those guys into your horde. They're the only blender I'm going to have right now. Threes. Not too bad. Mm, it's pretty good. Pretty good. Are you sure those dice aren't loaded? They are from, they are from Casino. <laughs> they are legit Casino dice. Yeah, Casino dice are loaded, obviously. Loaded to lose. Just like you, Joe. Oh. Is it three to wound? Three to wound. Minus one, one damage. Doesn't matter to Pasta you. Pasta Mazul. Six. Seven. 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 Take Ugh. it. Ugh. Take it, Weez. Seven. All right. Five up. Five up. Take that, Joe. Almost pretty good. Three passed. Reroll this one. Oh, it's cogged. No, oh, four, four more die. Oh, that's fine. I'll live with that. Boom, boom, boom. Oh god. All right. Looks like I'm gonna need. Looks like I'm gonna need uh, some uh, sweet, sweet uh, inspiring presence. <laughs> yeah. I think uh, these guys will. You'll probably see them on a tabletop. They're good enough for a tabletop. I think so mean? because three wounds each, four up save. Oh, I gotta go here. Right. A lot of attacks. Threes and threes is pretty good. Mm -hmm. like, and then later on when you add them to other Stormcast abilities, I think they'll be good blenders, good monsters. You know, yeah. just to kind of get through hordes and whatever. Yeah, I mean, you know, the Stormcast, they're just so weak, right? So they need, they need all the help they can get. Yeah, yeah. Just saying, you know. Everyone knows that. All right. And then just bump them along. Okay, cool. All right. 
So basically I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten dudes. Because like two ranks. Yep. There's only 25 mils. Yep. Ten dudes, 20 attacks. Oh baby. Okay, so this is uh this is just ten dice, so I'm just gonna roll this twice. I'll just resolve the first one. So fours and fours, fours. Oh yeah. Look at that. Four. Uh, and then fours. That's two so far. Two. And then Oh, I should have been re-rolling hit wound rolls of one. That's fine. Okay, I'll do that for the second one. Because I have over ten dudes. Okay, fours. No ones. I don't know if we had a No, no it's two wounds though. It was two wounds. Oh, it's two wounds. Okay. Yeah. And fours. Uh, no, uh, no one. So two more. Two so more? four, four total. Four? Yeah. Okay. Drag them down. How many wounds do they have? Four up. Three wounds. Four up. Save. Whew. All right. No rends. No. That's one. One damage. That's right. Let's Thanks. Put it on regular Jimmy. Jimmy, always Jimmy. All right. Sweet. All right. That's it. That's it. That's my turn one. Battle shock phase. I've lost seven dudes. Leadership Seven ten. dudes. Leadership 10? Leadership 10, because I have that guy. I might take the risk, but I have to keep the command point. Do I? What do I care? Uh, that's fine. Uh, yeah, I'm going to... I'm going to burn the command points. Forget it. Inspiring presence. Screw it. Okay. All right, that's it. This is it. Turn two, Joe. So you can inspire them at the end of the phase? Some people inspire them at the zero phase? No. See, that's the difference with Age of Sigma 2. You can do it... So, like, technically, let's say I had three command points. Yeah. And you, like, blew up a unit, blew up a unit, blew up a unit. I can inspire them. Boom, boom, boom. Oof. That's a big difference. Actually, hold on. I have to be within a certain range of the thing. Yeah. And I think it's pretty far, though. Inspiring presence is, like... No, it was 12, but that's with a general. My general's a knight of shrouds over there. Just past seven inches away. That might be too far. I might have to roll this then. No! My genius plan of not knowing how to play this game. Uh, four rules. Da, 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 da. Command abilities. Oh, here we go. Ah, it's six inches only. Bookmark that page. Huh? Bookmark that page. Why? Remember later. No, it's fine. But it's not so complicated. Okay. It's, not, it's not 40k for God's sakes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna play right. this game. Roll it. Oh baby. The four. Ah, I lose one dude. That's fine. That's not so bad. It's fine. I didn't think it'd be too bad because it's like alright, lose your ten or bravery ten. It's pretty good. Yeah. Alright, sweet. Round two. Initiative. I get a tie break. That's the difference with H Sigma two. Those that have start start get to, they get tie breaks basically. What do you mean I have, I have to beat you? Or you you have to beat me. I have to beat you by one. Can't tie. Because I get tie breaks. That's what that means. Yeah. All right. Roll it. Three, two, shit. <laughs> you want some, Joe? Come get it. Roll it. I'll mess you up. All right. What you gonna do? Start doing some hero stuff. So my Encantor. What's the range for Mystic Shield now? Is it still 18? It's the same. Um, I don't know. If it's 18, I'm in range. If it's not, I'm not in range. Okay. Well, well, I'll look this up in the meantime. You can like do some other stuff. I believe it's the same. Which was... I should know that already. But I don't in general. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 While you're looking at that, I'm gonna figure out what I'm gonna do. I got it. Do. It's right here. Okay. Eighteen. Eighteen. Yeah. Right. So I'm gonna mystic shield both guys. Go for it. Cause he is he is wizard. He is a wizard. You know what? What? I'm gonna mystic shield these guys. Cause Who? I think they're. Who's a wizard? He's he's a wizard. He's a wizard too. Yeah, he's a wizard. Uh. All right. He has magic and everything. I mean, sure. Yeah, because I think these guys are going to need... Would they have... The shield gives me reroll ones in combat? I don't know. You should know yeah. this. 
All right. <laughs> well, I don't yeah, play. Yeah, I'm gonna mystic shield them because this is scarier, and I want these guys to escape. Fine. Oh, failed. Seven. No, it passes. It's fine. Oh, we <laughs> so I'm gonna put this here that they are shielded. Sure. Show, show. Okay. What else you got? Uh, I will. I guess I can arcane bolt over there. Sure. Because I have nothing else for her to really do. Come get some. Uh, yeah, that's all she can really. All right, then do it. Cast it up. Oh. Five. You got it. It's good. And D3. Booby's in range to stop me, right? Oh, yeah, I'm in range. Yeah. He's in range. 30 inches. Would you roll nine? That's it? I roll a 10. No problem. Boom, 10. Oh, damn. <laughs> Take that, Joe. All right, fine. You got to roll it with confidence. Whatever, you got lucky. It's like game, you know? You got to have confidence. Well. You don't shoot. I do know. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and I will. I'm going to use, I can use my inspired presence later. So I'm going to do that. So I can save my command point. Go for it. Yeah, no. And you don't use it at the top of your hero phase. Yeah, I'm just. You only use it when you are going to test for bravery. Start. That's it for my hero phase. It's Let's a start rare condition moving. of this day and age. So she's gonna go like five. Mm -hmm. These guys are gonna stay where they are. Okay. Some people say it's even harder to find. You know the song? Well, I'm not paying attention to you right now. You're trying to distract me from whatever I'm doing. We're talking about. There's always time for the Family Matters theme song. There, that is true. You guys are going to be three inches away. Yeah. These guys are going to move there at five. Just watch. All of these attacks, uh, all these charges will whiff. They might. And I'll be laughing in your face. Okay. And then these guys are going to... That dude. The one dude. The one dude. Do I want to ride those winds? Because you're a hero, you just fly over me if you want to retreat and stuff like that. So I think That's I gotta fair. hold my back line. So he's just gonna kind of try and march block. Would I do that, Joe? Would I do that? Absolutely, you would. Would I? What do you take me for? I take you for an experienced player that will take advantage of my what weakness if possible. Oh, right. and my guys in the sky. I'm gonna hurry yeah. up. Yep, I come down. Look at this nudge gate over here. Nudge your own models by throw throwing dice at them. What would, what would Yoshi say? He probably what would, would Yoshi say? He'd be, he'd be proud. He would be proud. <laughs> Good job, Yoshi. Good job. Yeah, you're fine. You got to stay outside of nine, right? Yep. Nine inches. That's a cue from, well, 40K codified that a little bit more than Sigmar, but came from Sigmar first. Sigmar first. Hey, who knew that, uh, you know, deep striking and then getting to move uh, with uh, extra magic stuff would be pretty strong. Turns it's, out uh, turns, uh, turns out they feel like they needed to nerf that in 40k. It's like, oh, yeah, kind of thought that. Just like they nerfed Smite. It's like, yeah, who knew uh, Who knew uh, Unlimited Arcane Bolts was good? Oh, that's <laughs> really good, yeah. Like, yeah, Arcane Bolts are pretty good. All right. Uh, who knew that? Age of Sigmar for me. All right, let's All do right. this. Let's go to Shou shoot moving. Phase. moving. Moving is done. Is done. Everybody's moved. Shoosting. Let's Shousting. start with uh, those guys down there. Just All right, from the sky. All right, charges, combat. All right, what, what? and a turn. What? All right, so those guys are going to shoot at your one guy down there. All of them, or are you going to split them? How many wounds does he have? Uh -huh, like a million. I'm going to guess he has like four. He has five. He has five. I would rather just it's see him dead. It's equivalent. He's dead already. I told you. They're all <laughs> ghosts. Okay, I would rather see him removed. That's better. Okay, and then my hero is going to be the blue dice. Hits on a two. Everybody else hits on a three. Let's do this. And let's go. Good thing I shot all of them. Good thing you still have adjudicators. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and these do not Get explode. Get this garbage out of here. <laughs> these do not explode into extra hits. So oh. Just three to wound. Oh. Two wounds. One damage each. Ren means nothing. Ren means nothing to me. Four up, baby. Oh, oh double ones. Take them. I'm taking them. Take them. Unfortunately. 
We got two rooms. That's cool. All right. So I'm going to shoot you the... I count up it? just so that way people online don't get mad at me. What? The people will argue that counting up doesn't make any sense. Counting down makes more sense. It's arbitrary. Counting <laughs> down makes more sense? That's what some people will say. Right. No, no. I, I count up, so... Which way are we counting for this game? I count up. So you only took one round on that. Yeah, yeah, I'm just counting up. Okay. All right. Ballista is going to shoot at these guys. Bring it. Uh, I'm going to do the multi shots again. So we got five. You're liking those multi shots, eh? Uh, if it was like a single guy, and I would probably shoot the single one. Maybe. All right, just go for it. All right. So yeah, you flubbed that. Helmet. Yeah, you flubbed that. Helmet. That's why it's like it's either really good or it's not. I don't know. See, it'd be good if it was in cover. It would if you had shooting, but you don't. So it doesn't matter. I feel like it gets better if it's in cover. Oh, because it, it gets better save. It gets a better save. Oh, yeah. That's it. Garbage. Okay. Garbage. Continue. Um, that's all my shooting. Let's get some charges going. Nah. So these guys are going to charge. They need a three. They need a three. So not double ones. <gasps> no. Six. It's fine. Uh, they have a two-inch range, right? So I can't really get away from them. So you I'm cannot. Just gonna... Might as well come right at me. Come right at you. Because sure. I want this guy dead. Because he's... Gonna be dangerous. Well, you These guys over here. Yeah. Oh, they Four. failed, baby. That's called a failure. That is a failure. Sucks to suck. Sucks to suck. And I guess that's it. All right. All right. I will. I'm gonna start over here because I want to make sure that these guys do damage over there. What? Are you not worried about the chain rasps over here? Not as much <laughs> right now. So. All right. Let's do this. Those are. What you want? You want the Lord? Ex you want a piece of the Lord Executioner? I want all of them. All of them. Bro, you don't even know. So it's he's got. These guys have two attacks each. Do you realize I have a four up save? It's pretty good. It's pretty good. But uh, my leader has one extra attack. I hope that this box set is fine, because I don't know how I can have these like this. But whatever. I don't know either, man. We're that's just going by box art. That's what it has in the box. They're all that's separated. What, that's what it has. No, uh, this is definitely fine, because this is a three man unit. They it's this get, five man unit. All get great maces. Sure. It's all that. It's that five five man unit. That's weird. They don't all get great maces. They will get one great mace. Don't you? What are those? Those are regular ass maces, aren't they? These are regular ass maces. Okay, but you can only have one great mace within the unit of three. I know. That's what I was asking you before. No, but it's a unit of three, one great mace, and two regular maces, right? Then how do I have five? Okay, we agreed. This is weird. This one, though, should only have one great mace and two regular maces, right? Okay, so we'll, we'll stick with that. So the one great mace will be the What captain. were you going to do before? <laughs> go all great. I don't know. What the heck? Get out of here. the models. No one said that there. you could have three out of three great maces, oh, man. That's why it's weird. I don't know. How, yeah, I don't know. Your reading is weird. <laughs> okay. All right. Threes and threes. Suspect. Yeah. All right. That's some good whiffitude over there. Yep. Three hit. Horrible. Three hit. Excellent, excellent. Freeze. Looks like my Lord Executioner is going to live, Joe. Well, oh, so this... Those box cards mean nothing to me. The Rams mean nothing. This is two damage. Oh, this damn. is one damage. All right. Oh, so... I, okay, so the two damage one on a four up. Because they're working separately, right? Bam. On the regular one. Four up. No. Take one. Plink. That's fine. I'll live with that. It's cool. Yep. All right, over here, chain rasps. Let's do this. Pile in and mess this, these guys up. Get rid of them. It's fine. Because basically everyone's going to be able to swing now. Yep. All right, one of the guys out there. So I, got, I see like uh, seven, 11? 11, no, 12 dudes. 12. One, two, six. Yeah, that guy's hiding back there. You can borrow like a couple dice. Just like two. Like literally two. All right, this is 12. I'm going to roll them twice. Uh, hitting on fours, winning on fours. Uh, and you get to reroll ones to win. Reroll ones to win, yeah. Right. Oh, I'm glad my dice failed you. Yeah. Let's get this garbage out of here. And fours. All right, so that's three so far. And then the second wave. Fours. Uh, okay. And fours. Oh, reroll that. Okay, so that's another uh, four, so that's eight, right? You did three before. Three, so seven. 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 So seven total. Yeah, so seven saves. Four up. That's three wounds. That's one, one dead for sure. Two, three, yeah. So he's going to die. 
and then one, two, and move it on to other Jimmy. Other Jimmy. Uh, Little Jimmy. Okay, cool. He's dead. All right. So now they can swing? Yep. So, three, four, three. You killed one into shooting, right, from that one? Yes. Okay. And the champ has his extra. Okay. Threes. That's pretty good. Yeah. All right. And threes again. All ones, baby. Look at that. Eat dirt. Joe Dirt. Yeah, three. Sure. Take three. Go. Three. Three. Five up saves, baby. Okay. Oh, Come gosh. On. I made one at least. Yeah. Uh, two. Two. I got two. two Take dice. it. Yeah, that's fine. Not a problem. I am worried about that. All right. I'm now officially a 10 man. All right. Over here. The Lord Executioner. Let's do this. You did barely anything to him. You did nothing to him. One whole wound. Ooh, so scary. Up, oh, Joe. Look at me. La, la, la. Uh, okay. How many attacks are there? I have three attacks. Three up, three up. Rend two, damage one. But if I roll a six on the wound roll, it's two damage. Oh, I get to add two to the damage. So three damage. It becomes three damage. So six but I had the first hit first. Yes. So threes. Oh, two so far. And threes again. But the regular one's pretty good too. Ren two, right? So yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, okay. Ren three up. Oh, oh one. one. One at Ren two damage one. So five up. Oh. Garbage. All right. Cool. All right. Let's start with these guys then. That's a problem. You. Uh, all right. So we'll swing into here like that. Bam. Bam. Bam, and blam. Uh, what's the range of these guys? Oh, they got range two as well. How convenient <laughs> <laughs> for me. All right, let's start with the death knell. He only has one attack. It's a three up, three up. So let's do this. Three up. Oh, three up. Wounds. Minus? It's uh, minus one, damage two. Five up. Nope. Two damage. They have... No, it it does two damage, yeah, but uh, inflict by you know, they're allocating wounds. Inflict by this, uh. Oh, after allocating, okay. So I have to do that after. So uh, you didn't, you failed it, but I have to allocate the wounds afterwards. Okay. Because then I have to do the mortal wound type thing, basically. Okay, so okay. I'll just go like this. Okay, so two wounds are. Ready. One, yeah, that one went through. Okay, so I have two attacks for the rest of these dudes, which is there's three of them, so there's six attacks. Hitting on fours, wounding on threes. Hitting on fours. Oh. That was all. Oh, that, was, that was all of them, Joe. Oh my god. That was all of them. That's gonna hurt. Those guys are dead. Oh, because their buddies didn't come and save them. I'm not gonna say that they're dead, but they might be dead. They might be dead. Okay, threes. All right, that looks like four. I ran one, damage one. Odds again. Two more. Two. So I failed three in total. So two, so two uh so two went through, so two wounds right on him, on them. And then uh, it says allocate wounds inflicted by this unit's death now after allocating wounds inflicted by the, the sides. Each enemy model that is slain by wounds inflicted by death now like a damage took one enemy unit. Yeah. So so I did two off of I did two off the sides, right? Yep. That takes them down to one wound. And then basically no, these guys are regular guys. They so, only have two wounds. They only have two wounds? Okay, so that takes out one guy. Yes. And then the death knell himself takes out another guy. Because it's two damage. Yep. So two regular guys then are dead. And then uh, because you're within three inches, I get to do a mortal wound. So he takes one, a, he takes one more wound, yeah. Uh, one cool. All right, sweet. Question is, you haven't pulled me out of three inches from here. Like with these guys. Well, I don't want to kill the fine. No, I know. I'm just saying, but like you have, like you, I don't think you would have been able to pull, unless you went like the, like left them in here. I would, yeah, leave this one guy alive. But then these guys can still leave. doesn't matter. That's true. Yeah. So it didn't, doesn't matter. doesn't matter. Okay, cool. All right. So then the last thing is these guys. Three inches. Bam. Bam. Oh, baby. They're loving it. Just dribble in closer to me, Joe. Just dribble in. It's clearly the best strategy. Well, I needed those guys to make it in. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Now oh. the plan is ruined. And You failed, Sigmar. You failed. You failed. All right, cool. So I got these four guys. You fell from my trap, which was give up this entire side. 
Uh, oh, the stalkers. Okay, cool. The stalkers have two attacks each. So I have four dudes, so eight attacks. And then, um, what do they have? Four up, three up. But I didn't charge. Okay, so there's just four up, three up. Run nothing down to one. But I only got to get one through. Yep. Four up, three up. <gasps> whoa! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Missed bah, 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 bah. That's garbage. Okay. Uh, <laughs> That's right. That's right. Still alive. If I only had charge, I would have got re rolls, and that would have been nope. amazing. That would have been good. Okay. Nope. No attempt. That's fine. I will take that. Hmm? I will take that and um, live. Oh, but I have this dude. <gasps> no. How many ones did I roll? Uh, three, I think. Okay. Because I said here, I get to re-roll hits a one for any friend friendly at night haunting as like a holy within 12 inches. Oh, God. That's all of them. All right. Re-roll the three. I think that's... Yeah, 12 is good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So three of them. Let's try this again. Four up. Oh, one went oh, through. No. Three up. No. Oh, cocked. No. Oh, oh, went through. Don't fail, Lester. What do you have? A four up? Four up. So it's five up now, right? Uh, no, it's a uh, round and nothing. God, please. Yes! Ah! Ah, still alive. Okay, fine. You got lucky that time, Joe. I did. I'll take it. All right. Uh, so that's basically everything. Hold the line. All right, so battle shocks. So I, took, I lost... How many guys? I think I only lost like three guys on this, in this yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. So I'm good to go because I won't be able to roll more than 10. Okay, cool. Um, he's going to be bra bravery 7. So on a 6, he'll run away. I'm going to take that chance. Okay. Duh. Oh, and over here, these guys are bravery 8, which I don't think I can tell. You can't tell. Longer, so. No. You're fine. All right. Sweet. Let's go, we. Night Haunt. Turn 2. Bottom of 2, baby. What you going to do? All right, let's start with some magics, as they say in the professional Age of Sigmar uh, scene, magics. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to go do Spectral Lure with the Guardian of Souls. I'm going to... Uh, what does that do? Well, let me just roll it first. It says, it's on a six. Spectral Lure. Roll the seven. What does that do before I went uh, on my... It's either six D6 uh, models or D6 wounds. Within you. 18, yeah. Uh, I'm going to dispel with her. Okay, I rolled a 7. 6. All right, sweet. So D6. Dudes. 2. two. That's not that bad. No. It's still good. It brings you... You're going to have to be safe with your 10 models. Hmm? Like, unless I do really well in combat over there, you're going to get your extra models. What? What combat? Because of the 10 guys above. What combat? Later on. I ain't doing no combat. What? <laughs> what, are you, what am I, crazy? What am I, crazy over here? <laughs> All right. The Knight of Shrouds. He's going to use his command ability. I get to add a plus one to my attack characteristics to the weapons profiles. So do these guys. That's pretty good. And then, um, I don't know. That's basically it, I think. Cool. Um... Yeah, that's basically it. All right, let's do some uh, movement. Sh movement, as they say, once again in the biz. He's just going to bump over. He doesn't get cover bonus, but still. No, he doesn't have an armor save. Shut up. So, no, he has a save. He has a four-up save. Is it an armor save? Yeah, it's an armor save. Okay, so I have a three. It's ethereal. No, I don't, because I, I can't modify it, because I'm a ethereal. So why are you even bother? Just running away? Shut up. Okay, man, whatever you want to do. <laughs> All right. These guys are going to run. Run. They're going to yeah, move combat, get out of combat? No, I'm retreating. D6! On top, like, I'm running on top of my movement. Yep. So D6! Two. So eight. It takes me to here, baby. Am I inside of three? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah, six inches. Oh, I'm good. outside of three of you, though. Yeah, yeah. 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 Ex no excellent, excellent. You know what that means, Joe? Well, it means I gotta come back to get you. That's right. Which is fine. Is it fine, Joe? Yeah, because, like, 
use those guys down there to take out him and those guys to do damage. You ain't gonna take out nothing. I'm gonna try. You know why? Tell me. Because I'm cool like that. <laughs> <laughs> You know why you're not going to be able to do it? Because I have a secret up my sleeve, baby. Which is what? Which is that this guy moves 12. And you can't shoot out of combat. That's fine. And so shoot at him. That's fine. Shoot at him. No I'm worried. Joe's like, oh. I got my own tricks, bro. You ain't got no tricks. I do. I ain't scared of you. You're going to be like, oh, God, why? And it's like... Listen, I know your tricks. Oh, this guy moves so fast, he's going to take this objective, blah, blah, blah. I don't care. Am I? No, he's not, because he, then he can't charge. This is garbage. We all know this, Joe. All right. We all know this. All right, man. Why do you pretend? I'm not pretending anything. Why do you pretend? Anything else you'd like to move? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy. That guy? Yep. Just going to bump you back. It keeps you back, basically. Unless you zoom all the way over, which is possible, but I'll take that risk. It's fine. Um, that's it. All right. Charges. Over here. This is a key one. Six. I'm going to need a six, yeah. Okay. Six it up. Six. Oh, more than enough. 11, baby. I can go what I can do whatever I want. I can even have a large prize. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm gonna go like this. That's fine. I don't mind. Basically, I'll have like three of your dudes fight me. That's fine. I don't mind that. Uh, all right, let's do this over here first. Combat knife shrouds. Cause, just cause. All right. Okay. Four attacks with his sort of stolen hours and hearts. Okay, that doesn't matter. Cool, okay. So I hit on threes, win on threes, run one. Damage two. Boom, three hit. Wound on threes. One. Only one. Run one, damage two. Uh, five up. Get oh. out of here. Bullshit. <coughs> Oh, what was that? Oh, something's in my throat. Uh -huh. uh, okay, uh, two attacks with the hooves. Hooves will take him down. Four up, five up. Four up, down. Right, get out of here. Garbage. Okay. <laughs> Your hero sucks. Shut up. I guess now it's just... Your turn. My one guy? Or you can do these guys. No, they already fought. No. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? I'm just saying alternatively, you could do that. I could. So in theory. Do these guys have two wounds or one wound? No, oh, I think they have like one wound. One wound. And these guys have... These are the ones that you gave him the extra attack to, right? They got an extra attack, yeah. I would rather put it on there if he's within an inch. Or the... Yeah, it's one inch for that straight mace. You can't come over to me, though. No, I'm not. I'm measuring that one inch. But I can't really tell. I don't think you are within an inch, but let's take a look. Measuring tape. You are short of an inch. I'm short of an inch, so I'm going to have to put it... Either on the dude or on these dudes. Uh, I'm still really afraid of that guy, so I'm going to put it on your hero. Oh, baby. So the this is my ultimate distraction card effects. <laughs> uh, okay, so on to that guy. Threes. Oh, Ooh. hold on. You're wasting all of those. No, I'm not. Because in combat phase, each time you make a hit roll of six with an attack made with this unit's Storm Smite Great Maces, that hit roll inflicts D3 hits instead of one. So then that's like D3. Yeah, if the target is a demon or a night haunt. So it's 3d3 hits. 3d3, that's pretty good. Oh, buddy. Buddy. So 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7. That's a lot. 6, that's 7. That so it was definitely... It's pretty darn good. I mean, pretty darn good. 3 is the wound, baby. Oh. Um, yeah. That's okay still. 4. 4 is pretty good. 4. And is there 2 damage apiece? Are they? Yeah. Great mace. It's like the, the Grand Hammers. Same deal. So 4? Four ups. One goes through. Oh, so I'm at three wounds. Yeah. Bake them away, toys. <laughs> Bake them away. Let's start with a great... I'm going to start with him. Just because. Yeah. Just because just he pissed he, you off? He, need, he needs his... He, he almost killed your guy there. He needs to get his... Uh, all right, so three attacks. Three up, three up. Ren two, damage one. Four roll six on the wound. It's 
plus two damage. Two hit. Uh, we roll once for your guy. Why? Just check. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. Yeah. Hey. Hey man, I'm not gonna cheat this. All oh, right. I still missed anyway. All right. It was ne it was fate. And uh, six uh, threes Please. or sixes. Come on, no sixes. Oh my god. One. one. Ren two. Ren two. Damage one. Six. Nope. Dead. Dead. You did your job. He went out in style. Did he? Yeah, man. He did a lot of attacks. I mean... Yeah, that was as good as I could your, to your total damage was like three wounds on this one. Yeah, that was like max output. That's fair enough. Three sixes? All right. On that. On I that can't, guy. Can't ask All right. Me. Over here. All right. So I'm going to wrap those guys in for me. Three inches. You guys, just with their stalks because they're... They're shooting guys. They're shooting, yeah. Heavy stalks. So two, two attacks. But they only have range one, right? Like they Range don't, one, yeah. Yeah, so they can only they really fight one right. Two attacks with a stock, which is better than the, uh, the counterparts with uh, adjudicators. But adjudicators are adjudicators. Four, but fours and fours. But adjudicators are adjudicators. Yep. A, a boat is a boat. A mystery boat. A mystery box could be anything. It could be even be a boat. It can be a boat. It can be a boat. What do we got? Uh, three. Three. Three uh, straight up, one damage. Three straight up, one damage. What is this, Joe? Chipmunk guy? You trying to chipmunk me over here? Four up. Boom. It's caught. All right, three wounds. Ah, boom. Brr, brr. Bullet. Cool. Three on me. All right, sweet. That's it. I think that's it. That's it. That's the end of two. Bottom of two. That's the end of two. End of two. Top of three. Who's Top gonna, of three. Who's going to get it? You got the advantage. But this double turn would be sweet for me. Oh. Oh, oh yeah. I'll oh, take that double go. turn. Ugh. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Dr. Jones. Dr. Jones. No, Dr. Jones. Oh, baby. Yeah, this is going to be a little. That's going to be bad for you. Yeah, it's going to be a little rough. We'll see. We shall see. All right. Is this within 18? Yeah, that's, what, that's good to know. Cool. All right. Let's see. I'm going to try to heal them up again. On a six. Goes off on a nine. You want to try to stop it? Oh, oh, yeah. Definitely going to try and stop. I'll try and stop with her again. I mean, it doesn't really matter, but okay, sure. Well, because he's closer to those guys. Like, if you cast anything over there. I ain't casting nothing. I only, you notice I only casted one thing? All right. Get out of here. Get, get that garbage out of here. D6. Four. Excellent. No. The chain rasp cord is growing. Oh, Joe. Just suddenly, it just seems so lonely over here. <laughs> no. Okay. Okay. I can come back. All right. Um, can you, Joe? Can you? Um, the command ability for this guy. He's going to give uh, within 18. I think they're still within 18, right? Probably. Oh, yeah. 18 is your DC. We'll do that. So we'll use that on them. Sweet. All right. Um, yeah, all right, sweet. Let's move it. Let's get a move on it. I think I'm doing this right. I don't know. Okay, it's weird. Hold on. Is he good enough? Okay, that's fine. I'll do that. I'll do that properly this time. Spirit, Spirit Torment, six inches. Damn. I'm looking for a mystic shield. I think. What do you mean? Reroll ones or reroll. Reroll ones, yeah. Reroll ones, yeah. But they already have shields. So why did I do that? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Wow, oh, doesn't make sense to me. I'm not a storm gas player. I don't get rerolls to one just for free. I mean, I had a shield. I could take a different weapon. Could you? You don't even have an option for that. For them, no. <laughs> Get out of here, then. What are you talking about? We're liberators. <laughs> yeah, hey, 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 hey. Hey, me, I'm Joe. Hey. Are you shampoo? No, no need to be bitter. <laughs> Stormcast need, need more. They obviously need more because they're just so weak. <laughs> they're just so underpowered. I don't even know how anyone plays this army. It's like, ugh. Anyways, no one's telling you not to play Stormcast. I mean, my you conscience. Could. My conscience is telling me. Look at this stab. Look at the line of stabby knives looking to stab you, Joe. This looks like your Skaven army. Shh. With your big That's knives. I wish my Skaven army looked this cool. 
Damn. Yeah. Those, those sculpts need a, a redo. A little bit. Hmm? A little bit. Uh, did I move those guys already? No, I didn't. I just, no, uh, just summoned them. I just summoned them. But you're yeah. pretty much like, can't move them much closer. Basically, I'm just going to move them like, okay. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. There'll be three. Everybody's going to be like three. Yeah, I'm just going to like, I'm going to conga line up to your face. Back up, bro. Back up. Back up. Four dubs. Back that up. Fine. The horde is in your face. Well, you want to maximize your, your horde, right? That's what I'm doing. Wrap around. No, I don't want to. Or you want to wrap that one? I want to. I want to beat up this ballista. I don't give a shit about. She's, <laughs> she does some damage. Don't forget her thing. Is yeah, but three damage. Yeah, but I got, I got, I got priorities. I got kids. You know. You got no kids. No, it's fine. You left your kids when they died. It's true. <laughs> Just like a stormcast that way. <laughs> stormcast left all of their people behind. Dinner day, Joe. Didn't Probably, they? Yeah. All right. It's looking pretty grim there for you, Joe. It's not looking good, but we'll see what happens. That charge was a huge, a huge, huge mistake. Huge. You messed up big time. You messed up with the dice. You totally messed up everything. All right, that's it. No shoes thing. Uh, I give them a plus one. All right, charges. These guys first. Make it seven. Yeah, seven. Definitely gonna make it. Seven will take me all the way around this way. It's cool. Chink. All right. Then these guys. Eight. The question is, do I want to kill this chicken guy? He'll do some damage back to you. Hmm? He has, he'll do a lot of damage back. Yeah, I know. I know. That's why I don't want to. Where's your grand hammer out of all these guys? Don't you have two of them in here? I'm supposed to, but we just spread the, yeah, these, well, because I had them in the other game. So we'll just put them, doesn't matter. Just swap those guys out. Swap them in, because, Joe, what the hell? <laughs> put them wherever you want to put them. I see. I see how it is. All right, it doesn't matter. It's fine. Just swing into you harder here. We'll shake hotter boy. Shake hotter boy. All right. Boom. I was, am I still? Am I out of three? Me? You should be. Yeah. Looks good. Oh yeah. Three's good, right? All right. Cool. Sweet. And then this guy. Uh, am I outside of three here? With with him. I don't necessarily need to fight. That's fine. Okay, I'm technically within three, but nah. Nah. That's fine. I just. I'll do that for the pilot later. It's fine. Did he charge? He didn't charge. But if I'm within... Oh, no, I shouldn't be within three. Shouldn't be within I can't three. I can't be within three. Yeah. That's right. That's fine. So he's outside three. Over there. What I roll? Ten. Ten. Ten, that's it? So low. <laughs> ghost are in your ghost grill, man. They ghost. are all... Uh, what am I going to do? They're all in my face. I just have to hope that the engineers can do some damage. Go, engineers. They do actually. They have four attacks, oh. each. Yeah, it's pretty good. Melee weapons, sigmite blades. It doesn't say. Maybe it's both of those guys have, or four attack. I'm assuming. What? This is like probably for both guys, or is this per guy? I don't know. Read, read what. What are they equipped with? I think it'll say pretty clearly on there. All right, that's it for charges. Go and I hunt. I'm going to swing first with uh, these dudes, the uh, Reapers. I give them plus one to hit. It's treated as a single Oh, plus unit. one attack? Hmm? It's treated as a single unit, so that's four attacks and it's both guys. Oh, it's treated as one unit. Yeah, okay, it's so. one, one unit, one scroll. It's all one thing, right? It's all one thing. Yeah, okay, cool. Yeah, that would be great. Uh, okay, so the uh, Grimgrass Reapers, I'm going to start with a Death Knell. I have two attacks now because of a uh, thing. Uh, I give them plus one attack. And uh, that is four up, three up. No, uh, three up, three up. Three up. Uh, Reroll. Oh. And a three up. Oh. Garbage. And uh, the slides are three attacks each when I have three of them. So six. Uh, can I borrow two more dice? Yeah. Nine attacks. Hitting on fours, winning on threes. That. 
this one. All right, winning on threes. All right, so that's four saves. No, three saves, because that's his wounds. Three saves, so. Three saves at uh, rend one, damage one. So four up. Yeah, oh no, rend one. Rend one, yeah, so the, th or five up, sorry. Five up, three rolling, once. Let's go for it. So one guy's dead? One guy's dead. Regular dude. Cool. Duh. Okay. That's fine. I messed that up. Technically, you had a unit of five. I can reroll to hit. Uh, if you have a unit of five or more with, with these uh, scythe guys. That's cool. Oh. All right. That's fine. All right, Joe. Your swing. What you got? Uh, I got to try and put some out over here. Okay. How are you splitting them? Two uh, and two? Yeah, two and two. So put the, the big uh, maces over here, I guess. I have to. Okay. So, so the maces will be blue. Regulars will be red. And okay. Champ gets plus one. Okay. And it's three to three. Uh, hold on one second. They have their thing. Shield, blah, blah, blah. At the start of the combat phase, you must say if the unit will channel, channel their power into the weapons or the shields. If you choose its weapons, I can reroll failed hits. Failed hit roll for this unit. So I, I'm going to channel it into my weapons because I have Mystic Shield on. Which doesn't really matter. But. So reroll failed hits. Three. You reroll failed hits because of what? Because I'm it says, at the start of the combat phase, you must say if the unit will channel, channel their altheric power into its weapons or its shields. If you choose its weapons, you can reroll failed hit rolls for the unit in that combat phase. If I choose shield, I can reroll failed save roll. Okay, cool. So I want to I need to put some damage out. Sure. Threes, rerolling, which I didn't really need to reroll too much. All right. So That's pretty good. And threes again. Reds are on these guys, right? Blues yeah, are reds are here. Cool. Blues are here. Not too bad. Three and three. Three and three. Cool. These are two damage. These are one damage. The blues are over here, right? Yeah. Okay, so let's do these guys first. They're on uh, four up saves. Four ups. Two. Ooh, that's four damage. Whew. All right, so that's like one guy left. Because they only have one wound each. Okay. Right, and three over here. One damage. Yeah. Four up. I want to say. Yeah, four up. I made... Oh, that one's cocked. So one dies. Okay. Okay. Cool. All right. My attack's back. Yep. With uh, one guy? No, no. I'm going to attack over there. What am I? Oh, yeah. Hey. <laughs> What's up to you? Yeah. Yeah. All right. So uh, I should have had 16 dudes there. Um, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten guys. I think can go here. So we'll just do the, and one, two, the six. Three, four, five, six guys here. Yeah. Okay. Can I borrow three dice? All right. So I'll just do the twelve attacks onto the one, one lady. One lady. Yep. Hitting on fours, wounding on fours. And I get to reroll ones to wound because I have so many hits. All right. And so I have like three hits there. And one, uh, four ups. All right, one wound with a reroll, two wounds. Cool. So I got a three up save. <laughs> Loss. Garbage. Okay. And then uh, you said I had ten dudes, right? Yeah. Five. Okay. Ten. I'll just do this twice. Mm -hmm. uh, fours and fours. Dun -dun. Okay. And fours. Reroll. Okay, so that's three. Three. Four up save. Two. How many wounds do you have left? I have seven total. So five left? Five left. All right. Your combat or your your so attack? So two. Uh, so I'll, I'll do the wizard first. Three attacks. Threes and threes. Two threes. Pretty good. Threes. So one. Uh, 
minus one doesn't matter, and DC damage comes in. What's that? Sorry. One is what? One. Some hurt from the wizard. Five up. Nope. No. DC damage. Two. Two. Okay. You care? No, I'll take it like this. Okay. It's fine. Yep. And you don't have any more attacks. Yeah, right? I do. I got this guy. Oh, yeah. But he didn't charge. He's out of three. This dude. This guy. Yeah, go. Go. You were about to deny me my attacks here. Under. You can't deny it. All right. Uh, four ups. I got to reroll to hit because uh, I charged. And reroll. Okay. Uh -oh. And uh, one down three. No. All right, then. Sweet. So do the ballista. Four attacks, fours and fours, one damage. Fours. Fours. Oh. Ballista is sucking. Hard. Yep. All right, Knight of Shrouds. Four attacks. Hitting on three, wounding on threes. Wound one. Rend one. Threes. Two hit. Threes. Two wounds. Rend one. Damage two. Yeah. Dan Ren one, right? Ren one. Yeah. So we're good. Hooves. And hooves. Two hoof attacks, four, five up. Uh, nothing. All right. Okay. So I'll finish off with those guys. I'm going to wrap that one guy in. He's not going to be able to make it in, but okay. Well, if I put him between your bases, it'll be less than an inch. I would hope so. Uh, so if you do this, you mean? Yeah. I don't think you are, but you have to get pretty... Tight, because you're, you're on big bases, right? Yeah, okay. If I can't, then move them like another inch till the next round he'll be in if he's still Sure. In. Okay, so just the three guys? Yeah. Two attacks each. Uh, champion does not have the extra one. Uh, where is it? Four than fours. Whew. Two hit. Two. Ooh. Okay. Two. Another shot. It's four up. One. Ooh, take it. How many do you have left? Two more wounds. Ooh, this guy's shooting dead. That's if you can. All right, okay. that's it. Okay. So uh, battle shock. I've um, got one on the grim grass reapers. They're fine because they have bravery ten. The stalkers I lost four of. Yeah. So if I roll a six, it's a ten. So I can't fail that attack. I don't know what's your bravery. Ten. Ten. Yeah. Okay. That's it. And I lost two of these guys, but they're at 10. So they're fine. Yeah, so they're fine. You lost... I lost one guy here. Yeah. So he was wounded five. So... No, I can't fail. Bravery seven. Yeah, then you can't fail. Can't fail. Yeah. And I lost one guy over there. Yeah. Same thing. Bravery seven. Are they bravery seven? They are. Bravery seven. Okay, cool. Yep. And that's it. My turn three. Bottom of three. All right. Hero phase. Let's see what we can do. So. Okay, we know it's gonna shoot to me. So let's try and snipe off that character, I guess. Cause you're gonna take you're gonna take this objective almost for sure. There's nothing I can really do about it. Uh I mean you could do something about it. You can send those guys over there if you want. Yeah. So if I can kill him with those guys, so shooting in combat, mm -hmm. then they can swoop over and steal that if he's dead. You can and sweep over and take it even if he's not dead because they got four guys. I've got one model. Yeah, uh, I'm just trying to think long term. We still got another round before anything really happens, so I got to position them right. So if I go this way, I'm smashing it. If I go that way, so I think I'm gonna have to sacrifice this and hope for the best that he grabs the other three. All right. So he's going to uh, Arcane Bolt that guy? Sure. Because... Come get it. Roll it up. You need a five. Hang on. Let me just check something. What do you got to check? This guy's within 18. This guy's at six. Each enemy unit within 18 suffers a mortal wound in addition, blah, blah, blah. So if I can, I can get a mortal wound here and a mortal wound there for free. Same as Mystic Shield. Because Mystic Shield... Or sorry. Arcane Bolt is just one, right? Yeah. Yeah, so... No, he's out of 18. I'm out of 18 anyways. Yeah. Okay, so... Arcane Bolt is 18? Yeah. 
so I can't even do that anyway. Yeah. So I might as well just cast it here. Onto the chain on the chain rest board. Yeah, because I don't have anything else. Or I can mystic shield these guys. That's what I'll do. This okay, go for it. Guys. No. All right then. Full waste of time. Uh, this guy is gonna cast his arcane bolt on him. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna try and wipe him out. Actually, I'm gonna cast it on him. How many wounds does he have? He's uh, running like four or something. He's got five. Five. Oh. Go for it. Because he's given the bonuses, but he's more dangerous, I guess, in combat. I don't know. Uh, I guess so. Spirit Armor doesn't do too much. No, it's oh, on, yeah. on, on those sixes he can do. Actually, he's not bad. Yeah. He's not bad. I'll, I'll do the arcane bolt on him. Okay. Four. Hang on. What's that special one that they have? They have. Uh, I don't know. And scroll something. Sequiturus. Because there's still two. Or not sequiturus. Evocators. Evocators. There you go. They're gonna empower themselves, and that gives them. Reroll all failed wounds. To who? To themselves. Uh, Isn't it them over there? It is them over there. So, you know, I'm going to put it on here. Why? Because How can you do that? I can... That, they're not they, evocators. They're sequiturs. If you cast it on... Whatever, hold on. What are you talking about? <laughs> I can empower them if I want to. As you long did as that. they you have the did. sacronist keyword, which everything in the army does. Everything in the box. So how did you do that last turn when you killed all my guys? Well, that was their uh, power. So what are you doing now then? I'm doing the... Hold on. There's empower the spell. Uh-huh. Right? And then there's... Where is it? The ability... Channeling. Channeling was the one that gave me the rerolls. Okay. So if I... Empower them and channel their weapons. I can reroll all hits and reroll wounds. Uh, okay, sure, sure. I don't, know. I don't know. Sure. So what are you doing now, then? You're doing what? I'm gonna empower them, and then when well, I well, you can't do that in close combat. Like that's for close combat, right? That's now for you're close still, you're still in hero phase, right? Yeah. So what are you doing now? You're doing what? I'm gonna empower them so that in the combat phase I can reroll, uh, roll wounds from him. Actually, I think his command ability... Are you sure about this? Here you go. He, has, he gets it for free. I don't even have to roll. 